Welcome to the video sharing today. Um, I get these questions a lot actually from uh, insurance agencies or even some you know corporate companies. They ask, Jason, do you think Facebook ads is suitable for recruitment? Okay, and as in like for recruitment, as in recruiting new agents, recruiting new members to your team and all this kind of thing. My answer is yes, but let me teach you how to do that right after this video. Where's that, where's that, pull that up. <laughs> What is the minimum spend that I should be putting aside for Facebook advertising? How do we measure success of a Facebook advertising campaign? How can I constantly reach fresh audience with my Facebook advertising campaign? I've got a few thousand people who like my Facebook page, but when I post anything, why am I reaching so few of my friends? This is where you choose Facebook Ads Objective. Three categories, we have awareness, consideration, and conversion. Now let's walk through each and every one of the ad creation options available. How can we do hyper-location targeting plus ad scheduling? Today we're gonna to talk about the customer journey or so-called the Facebook advertising customer journey that you can build you know, for your audiences. We try to answer at least two to three questions every week. And uh, of course, from time to time, I'll share tips, new findings or new developments when it comes to Facebook advertising. Uh, you keep up on the pace of what's about to come, what are the changes that uh, you should be expecting. So, welcome in. My name is Jason. For those who are new to me, I help businesses grow, leveraging on effective Facebook advertising and digital marketing techniques. I've been uh, running a boutique agency since 2010. Over the years, I've helped over 200 brands navigating success with effective Facebook advertising and digital marketing techniques. And uh, I've started training since 2016. Over the years, I've helped close to 4,000 individuals from various countries, including Malaysia, Indonesia, Philippines, Cambodia, Vietnam, and all that, you know, to navigate a success with different way of doing Facebook advertising in a more effective way. So if you're new, consider smacking on the follow, subscribe, and the like button so that you'll be notified whenever I post new video that I share tips about Facebook advertising and digital marketing. So this is what I get, especially insurance agent, um, corporate companies, they always come to me and say that, hey, Jason, I thought that Facebook advertising is for, you know, sales oriented kind of activities or kind of, kind of advertising. Is this suitable for, um, what do we call, uh, for recruitment? So uh, my answer is yes, but you have to be very careful when it comes to uh, recruitment. Essentially, if you're doing Facebook ads for recruitment, you are actually using Facebook ads for lead generation because you're not actually getting these people to click and buy something from you. You're more like getting these people to actually click and submit information to you. So let me bring this up. Okay, basically, this is really the Facebook ads objectives available. For those who are new to this, you probably want to navigate. You just need to type Facebook ads manager or something like that. Then, you know, you know just follow the steps to come in here. This is where you start when you're advertising on Facebook. So there are different objectives available. We have awareness, consideration, and conversion. Each one does its own specific objective or purpose. Okay, it's really important for you to understand all this in order to do it right. Now, when it comes to recruitment advertisement, you should consider a few things. But the, I mean, the, the, the one that I actually like the most is lead generation. Now, Lead generation essentially is, you know, when you run lead generation advertisement, you're actually getting people to fill in the form by answering certain questions and all this kind of thing. Now, they are quite, this is really powerful. When people see that, they click immediately, a form will pop up within Facebook, and then, uh, you know, they will have their name, email address, and everything pre-filled. And on top of that, you can ask more questions. Uh, you know, this is where you can start getting information. And uh, you can actually ask them questions like whatever you want, you know, uh, things like what is your previous experience? You can get a few in all these answers. Uh, the trick here is you want to make this form slightly more complicated than normal ones. Okay, for, because for normal ones, you probably want to use it to generate leads where you want to minimize the friction. You just want to get to the right people. I mean, you want to get the number in, but for recruitment, I would say you want to actually do some filtering because um, the idea is, you want to let them do a little bit more work by giving you more information. So lead gen works pretty well. Now, the other way that you can do this is to use traffic and go for either your own website or you can actually bring them to a Google form. Now, when it comes to Google form, then you are able to, of course, the same thing, ask questions, uh, even to get them to upload their resume and all this kind of thing, which you have a little bit more control. 
And uh, of course, other things such as there are many different types of form type kind of uh, services out there that you can use. The idea here is you want to make sure, okay, the process should be, you want to pre-qualify them by getting them to answer questions or even to do some actions before they give the information to you so that you'll be able to reduce the time that you need to process all these, you know, applicants coming in. So when you run ads, of course, you know, you can just go to the audience that are more likely to take the action that you want. Basically, that's how you work. So if you want to learn more on how to do Facebook advertising in a whole new way, we do offer this six day challenge where in six days time, every day, you know, it's like a six day in a row kind of thing. Every day, uh, I will teach one key topic about how to do Facebook advertising, right? And then uh, after the one day training, it's about an hour or so, and you will need to go back and do your homework, right? Six days in a row, you'll be able to have a complete full functioning campaign using my two-step funnel framework that really marvelously increase your multiple, I mean, your, your ROI as in your bottom line, and uh, it will actually help you reduce so much uh, budget waste and you know overall increase the performance of your Facebook ads campaign. Proven with over millions, tens of millions um, guided and managed using this method, and I really want to share with you in a very, very simple layman way that you can use it for your own right away. So I and I encourage you and I invite you to join my six day challenge. Um, the link is in the description and I look forward to see you in the next challenge. So this is it. This is the short sharing that we have. Uh, remember to smack the subscribe, like, follow button so that you'll be notified whenever we post new videos, uh, you know, about Facebook advertising and digital marketing. So till then, I'll see you. See you soon in the next video. Bye.